You've ever wondered why barbers have so many tools? Like, if you ever went to a barber shop, they have a lot of clippers. And when I say a lot, I'm talking about like a lot, like four, five, six, maybe even seven tools. And there's a good reason for that. And in this video, I'm gonna explain to you why we have so many tools. We actually use all of them in a haircut. So stay tuned, check it out. Make sure you don't go anywhere because this is why we use so many tools. All right, you guys, this is basically my setup right here whenever I'm doing a haircut. I use every single one of these tools. So let me explain to you why I have all of them and what I use them for. For example, this one right here is my zero fading tool right here. So I only use this tool when I'm doing zero fades. And this is the tool that gets out like the half guard. I do a half and then zero and then blend that out. And then for the next one, this one right here, it, all, it has a half guard on there, you can see. This half guard always stays on this tool. It never leaves this tool at all. So whenever I'm doing this, I'm just cutting hair and then the next thing you know when I'm done with that, I pop on my half guard. Well, not really pop it on, but I pick up this clipper and then I start using it as a half guard. That means that this one right here is my number one guard. So this number one guard is the guard that is always on this tool, this Argo right here. Pretty cool clipper. Um, used better, but this is pretty good. Like the size and the way it holds. But for exactly like the half guard, this one always stays on this guard. So I'm cutting hair and I'm using this and I'm fading it out and then all I do is just pick up another tool and then pick up another tool. Instead of finding like the guards and popping it on each clippers when I'm using it, I just pick up the tool. It makes things a lot easier. And as you guys can see, they're all different. So I know exactly what clipper I need on my next step. Moving on. This tool right here is usually used for heavier, thicker hair because it's a detachable and it's a metal guard. It's super strong compared to something like this where it is strong, but it's just not as strong as an Octane. Octane is really, really powerful. And when you're using this, I'm taking down folks or I'm doing clipper of a comb because it cuts everything I need. So this is like one of my favorite tools of all time. I've used this forever and I haven't changed it. Only when it is broken or something, but it lasts years, you guys. Best investment ever. And then this, this is like my tool to take down to skin it. So right before I skin it, I use this to use the guideline. I take all the hair down and then underneath, I would use the shaver. The shaver is something I'll use to remove all the hair, the little stubbles of hair left on the client's head. Same thing with this shaver. Okay, this is the shaver in the video that I showed you guys last time. You guys haven't seen it, make sure you check that out. This shaver right here is a combo with this one. So that's really dope right there. The next up is a T-liner. Okay, why do I have this and why do I have that? This is definitely the sharpest not in term of like cutting people sharpest, but sharpest as in term of lining up the client and making sure it looks good. This is the best I have ever used. Like even till this day, no matter how many wireless they came out with, this has not failed me. Like this has been the best and I have not seen any, any wireless that is as good as this. So I use this to edge up the client, line up the front, line up the beard, line up around the ears, line up the neckline, line up the sideburns, whatever it is, even doing a hard part, this is my go-to clipper. And it might look different than you, yours because I did cut the top right here. So the top's cut off and it's easier to get around the ears and it's easier to clean. I know that, you know, after the clients you have hair here, so that needs to be clean. <laughs> Other than that, you guys, this is not as good. So I use this to take down bulks and remove all the hair, okay? so. That's what I use that for. So we pretty much got through all of my clippers. We're not even talking about the comb or the guards or these guards and what they're different. So you guys have to stay tuned, subscribe to this channel. Make sure that you like this video too so then you'll get notified for whenever I post a new video. That's how YouTube usually works. So if you guys don't subscribe or don't like, they'll just assume that you don't really wanna watch this channel. Well, if you guys do, 
make sure you hit that like button and let me know what you guys want to learn in the comment below this is why barbers have so many clippers and this is why i have so many clippers we're not even talking about scissors yet that's insane all right you guys i'll catch you guys in the next video my name is andy make sure you hit that subscribe button see you later peace